Hey, just working on trying to unravel the mystery of the unique fish. And what I think I've landed on is they are just like the sharks. It doesn't matter um, what water depth you fish at. You don't need to use the bait preference. Um, so Randall and I, Mr. Bait Slinger, we're going to be going after neither one of us have the um, unique football fish. He's going to be fishing it like he's going for the Atlantic football fish. So he's going to be going crankbait on bottom. I'm going to fish top water um, at just a green fish. You do not need to be on expert for the unique fish. So I've been doing it like the fish buffet. And on the last board, um, we went for the yellow fin. What is it called, Randall? The uh, Orange fin spade fish. Orange fin spade fish. And I completely ignored everything about the fish. And Randall went for its counterpart using the bait preference and water depth that matched and i caught mine the first one on bottom with a dough ball and i think like my third cast which is nothing near what it would want and randall kept fishing the um the bait preference for the other spade fish and i caught two more ignoring the the bait and water depth and so i caught three before he caught his first one so now we're going to do something similar on this fish, haven't caught it before, neither has he, and see if I can get that kind of demonstrated um, in a video. And the fish buffet method definitely works. Just pick a fish, catch and release it. So I'm going to aim at whatever this fish is out there. Top water. So my hunch is it's just like a shark, and it just the game is going to give you one when it gives you one. I think this is the fish that most people are asking about as well and that would make sense because it's a middle bottom fish which are the hardest ones to kind of fish at anyway i hate middle bottom fish or middle only fish are the worst you get no indication if you have to fish on expert and again the fish buffet method just like with the sharks is solely we're just speeding up the process they're they're there's nothing about it that is magic. It's just you spend more time, you know, hooking fish than reeling in fish. Oh, a little wacky. Let's go over there. No, let's go faster to recast. Started reeling that in. Don't need to reel it in. So I think for the water depth and um, bait preference, well, they don't show you bait preference for the unique. I think for the water water levels, I think all they really did is just copy and paste the information from its matching silhouette and just remove the bait preferences. Now, the fish do not show up on the fish finder. So I'm fishing for whatever this fish is out here. You'll never see the unique on, so you can't, you know, keep refreshing and look for something that, you know, never changes color, like you never, never changes green or anything like that. Not going to work. Just keep catching fish, and the unique will eventually jump on your line. One thing I didn't realize when I first started trying to investigate this, because in beta, they started us with one of every fish. You do have to have every fish on each level before you can catch the unique, so I... Waste it up. Here we go. There is the counterpart to the football fish. Whatever. I'm, I don't know if it's got football in the name. Like I said, I've not caught one. I've been had surgery and just been doing some other things and have not had a time to really unpack VR fishing yet um, other than beta. And all I did on beta were the sharks. So there's kind of proof that so Randall's been following the water depth and bait preference of this fish 
as if it were the non-unique one, and I just kept catching some random fish over and over, and I've got mine. So it was an instant bite on top, which would not be for the football fish with the soft bait on, and um, fish took it. So at the end of the day, I'm standing behind these act just like sharks. The game will give you one when it wants to give you one, and the very fastest way, um, if you want to try to catch them or catch a certain number of them in a short period of time, would be to use my fish um, buffet method. And here you go. Not seen this fish in person yet. Make sure I don't bonk my monitors here. See if I can look down its mouth. There. Alrighty, so hope that helps some people on their quest for the uniques, and as always, best of luck and happy hunting.